Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dolbeck. Today I'm gonna show you how to be the best villain in your world. You see, this is my fire staff. And you see, this is you. You see, this is how it's done. And when you use another weapon, look. Yeah, yeah, this part is for the dude who disliked my video. Yeah, yeah. This is you. This is a blunderbuss. Yeah. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dolvek. Today, I'm going to tell you how to become the biggest villain in your server in your world at You see, I've been one of the biggest villain ever in this game. Probably the biggest. And I'm going to tell you why and you're going to understand. There was a point in my server where everyone almost was hating me and i had a couple friends but most of the people was hating me and you will understand how i did and it was pretty funny i had a blast doing that you know being the villain is like you're into a virtual world you know so your content you know you're like the final boss in pvp of your server if you want to become like the final boss, this is like almost the tutorial how to become the final boss of your server, you know? And I don't even like brag, this is it. like straight up what happened, alright? So I was the first ever in New World to have 4,000 kills. You see, there's the title that you gain when you kill 4,000 of your faction, your color. How to kill 4,000 people of your color? You need to go in OPR and do it because there's no other way to do it. So at the start, there was only OPR and no 3v3. So I had to kill 4,000 people in OPR of my color to gain that title. And I was the first to have it. And I'm going to tell you how I did that. All right. So what happened? is at the start of the server you see i'm a pvp -er, I always like the small scale pvp when i do 1v plus and if you look my call of duty video this is the only thing i do almost so 1v plus all the time and then i i get into this mentality straight at the start of the game i already like i you see i did a couple mmo in my in my life so i, I was already doing split you see and most of the, the people took a long time to discover the musket with the split intel and dex. When I was level 30 or 40, I was already playing with the musket rapier. I have a lightning gem in my musket and my rapier. And I was doing split int and, and uh, dex. And I was and I got a 1v2. You can see in my video, I'm like level 30 or 40 and I got a 1v2. I'm at half health and I don't even use a potion. I just beat them half health 1v2 and I'm a musket user level 40. Already doing the split when nobody knew that build. I was almost one of the first to use that. And then I, I started to switch around my build, you know, and um, I discover like a uh, musket uh, IG that was good in that moment. Uh, fire staff, fire staff IG. So I was like always running a uh, those weapon like a musket rapier and fire staff and ice gauntlet and i was doing in rotation and I, I i was like just having fun with those build and then there was the chest run when you reach the end zone i was one of the first to reach the end zone i saw the chest run start to form at the start you're gonna see people are gonna reach the end zone and then they're gonna form and then like at 6 p.m there's going to be the world tour of this and then at 8 p.m. the world tour of this and then since it was the start of the game the, the people was doing world tour but flagged so yellow flagged world tour 6 p.m. purple flagged world tour 8 p.m. so when you're green I was green I was waiting for the yellow and the purple uh, flagged chess run and when it was starting I was following them like in the mine in Mergard or like wherever it was ebon scale in the mountain and stuff and i was just fighting with them and killing them and then dying and then laughing and i had a good time and then at the start nobody like it, i was just you know someone coming and having the banter but when it kept happening people kept some 
hate on me and then after a moment i always had some people hating me in the chat but it was not too bad it was still not my color you see what i mean but then there was a company chess run like this but of my color so i was like okay i'm gonna follow it and then it it's a, it was a flagged company chess run and i was not in that company but i still followed them and i'm you see i'm french i did not really read what they were saying but during the whole time it seems like they was complaining that i was there during the chess run i was just following them it, taking the chess and they did not want me there and then after that moment everyone started to hate me in my color because i was there during a chess run that i was not supposed to be there bro i'm just taking chess bro just let me take my chess you see what i mean so i always took my stand and like i bro i did nothing wrong and they always took their stand too and that rivality lasted forever like a year a year and a half everyone hated me so yeah this was crazy like you see there's a chat the word chat every time i, I was spoken the word chat someone was hey don't they, I, I hate you or whatever and then the uh, selling an item always someone like it was like that the, the, the people in your world i don't know they have something against you and you can see like my video past uh, 15 day had no dislike and then poof one day i wake up and all my video have four dislike like it, it's those same dude that ate me and it's probably a small youtuber between them that have like a couple account to youtube probably his children account youtube and just go dislike my video with it all at the same time you see it just happened at the same time if it was a dislike here a dislike here i would be like oh okay it's not the same dude but now it's like bro i know it's you i i know who you are like it's not hard to to know who you are and you just ate me for that bro yeah get farm so i became the server final boss i teabagged every single kill almost uh I, I teabag properly, you see what I mean? When you kill someone in your world, they see you like a bit into the death cam uh, uh, before respawning. And during that time, you have the time to emote on their body. You have the time to teabag or like you 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 just uh, lay on the ground and spin, whatever. The, you, with the the with the blunder boss, when you teabag, it's even better. Like there's some weapon that when you teabag with it with the, the bow. When you turn on the bag and you see bag, you can get some amazing posture. So you gotta make sure to use that to be as much toxic as possible, right? So you need to keep provoking people to make sure that the fire is burning, but keep it banter. Like there's some word that you need to make sure that you don't use. I never got banned for those banter in the chat, but some people got banned because they it was eating me for real but i always kept it as a joke with them and I always had fun doing it and yeah like i never said like the n word in the chat or like real insult uh, like yeah, whatever you see keep it banter it's really important and you you need to remember that you are content uh, it, it's a just like a spin a reel that you need to make spin to make the the life better for the server like having a villain is like one of the best thing you can have in a server having a group of people ch like you're into a group and you see someone that you don't like and you all chase it together it's like it, it just how it be you see it's one of the nice thing in the game and you, like you, you will understand what had happened if you're not understanding now all right so yeah you go at the end game zone seek for chess run flag and you win them all right uh, if you follow the like the end of the train it's gonna be easier to pick up people than if you attack the start of the train and then the people are gonna pass on you all right so just follow the end of the train and pick up some kill uh when you do that it's almost better to use a multi-target build so you can uh, it on the clump or you're gonna use a single target build and then you're gonna separate the people that are more in the back of the the group you see what i mean and you're always gonna have to stay pvp on so you can fight people into the open world uh, as soon as you see that you're if you're near to lose like 
I don't lose that much 1v1 in New World, it's pretty rare, but when I see someone with like the build that is opposite as mine, like when you're a mage, if you fight someone with a sword and shield and spear, like there's just nothing to do against it. If it's my friend, I'm gonna accept to die by him because it's my friend, but in a real PvP uh, area, I'm just gonna like get out and that's it. You see, like it's not my role to fight him, I'm not gonna fight him, like I have no so you need to, to know which 1v1 to take so you don't really lose 1v1 like i never really lost a 1v1 in new world like uh, maybe uh, in the opr like but in a really 1v1 situation so people really see me like the final boss they cannot gauge my um my skill because i only take 1v2 and 1v3 every time in a 1v3 i'm a try if i'm in a 1v1 they, they cannot kill me and I always come back when they are weak and get them like you see what I mean like I'm gonna come back and, and get them if they don't get me and like it's just always been like that you know so this is one of the mentality to be a villain you see what I mean like just to be the final boss you need to stay the final boss if you if you give yourself too easy it won't work all right so um the skin you're gonna see your skin can have a huge impact when you teabag someone if you rage or not there's a bunny skin that come with the easter egg event you can tint it in black or whatever it looks very good there's a couple outfit like that like the mario bros skin uh, you're gonna see i have a tutorial for that uh, there's the spider-man skin uh, i've seen the flash gordon there's a couple nice skin like this you put this on and you teabag your opponent as much as you can all right so what i've seen some people do and it's pretty smart i never did it myself but seriously i feel like those people know what they do you go into the auction house you undercut people and then you say it in the word chat oh uh the price of the steel was low and uh, nah, nah, i undercutted you or something you, you just say the flip that you just did and you undercut or you see you, you just managed to fuck up the market of someone and you're happy about that go say it into the word chat i've seen some people argue with each other during a long time just because of those you see what i mean Th this is really how it is so if you, there's some people of your color that don't like you you see when that team uh make me a bad a bad boy in the server when that that thing that didn't like when i follow them in the chest run and then they ate in me and all my color what is it was hitting me guess what i saw them the day after and they was running a corruption portal group all together the a team group again so guess what this time i follow them you're gonna see in merc guard there's some place with corruption portal and crocodile and at that time the people had, had a really hard time to beat those corruption portal because it was new in the game so when they did it <laughs> i just bait all the crocodile on them and then they died <laughs> and then i teabagged their buddy and bro believe me in your world if you can manage to do a big pull on some people like on a song on a train of people they're gonna die like there's just no way for them to survive if you manage to do it well all right so you need to make sure to have some friend i have a friend called galdrello this dude he was the perfect uh villain you see what i mean this dude was doing everything uh he was playing with a life staff but with the aggro gem into it or with a ted yeah it was a ted and like he was putting some perk on it just to aggro more and like chain or like chain arcane chain fires stuff like that he was just doing everything when he if the tank was doing bad into his dungeon and he was not liking the tank he was switching the life staff for a aggro life staff just to piss off the tank and he had a, a couple stuff like that it was like bro you're really doing that and then i'm in the discord with him i'm doing a, a dungeon and this dude is doing a dungeon by himself and he's there laughing because he's not healing the people right and like imagine you have an healer in your group that is not healing because he just laughs when you die bro 
this dude i love it this dude like he killing me so many times like just thinking about it and listen i'm a good tank in the game so he was pulling the wall map my healer listen i was pulling like the biggest pull as i can and then my healer was running away he was dropping his heel and then he was running away and then coming back with even more mob imagine in depths someone pulled every mob on you like every and then i was there just tanking and he was there and he was eating me and he was a good healer you know i was able to do it but most of the tank was just raging after that dude because everyone was hating this dude for sure like it was so fun so make sure to have some powerful rival my rival was q feed during a moment at the start you see after a moment you you are in the same server during years so most of the people are gonna become your friend like there's just no way to don't become your friend after a moment but at the start it was like my rival in the chat like uh, it was the only one in the server that the people was like oh q feed gonna beat you if you see him no 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 i'ma tell q feed and then like you see we never like one v one each other or anything but like you see it was like the rivality was there there was like two big names and, and people was like ah oh, so those are gonna fight each other or something and it was like i did like in the in the wrestling like there's a back story a background like it would be like that so yeah at the end you need to remember that this is all just banter and uh, the server is small and getting really small with time. New World is not a big game. So you are going to become friends with the people who hate you. And uh, whatever. If you're the dude who dislike me, it's fine, man. Do <laughs> whatever you want. I don't care. But I just want to let you know that you are reacting to my video by disliking my video. So you are pushing my channel into the algorithm. So I want to thank you. So I'm a good villain by the way telling you that I want to tell you guys to have a good day. Tell someone you love them. Peace out.